Welcome to my channel. My name is Talentia and I am a mom who is trying to get her family to financial freedom. I'm paid two times per month for my part-time job and all of my other income comes from side hustles. So I was talking, recording, going over my budget of what I made, what I was going to do with the money and I realized my phone was not recording. So um, you didn't miss much. I uh, just went through my numbers and I can do that really quickly with you. Side hustles, DoorDash, which you already know um, I do. I made $144. Now, um, I didn't dash um, like I had intended on doing, but that was because our family was having some family time. And so I was, you know, just enjoying family time. Um, and then Etsy, oh my God, <laughs> Etsy, we, I made $68 on Etsy, very excited about that, and also $15 on Big Cartel, so thank you to every single one of you who purchased anything, thank you to those who have shared um, our posts, thank you to anyone who's gone on to our Etsy shop just to t check it out, like some items, we appreciate all of the support, it's been insane um, how much love we've gotten um, on our Instagram and, and Etsy and Big Cartel. So thank you, thank you, thank you. We appreciate each and every one of you. Um, now, this was just my portion from Etsy and Big Cartel. Um, I do have, sorry about all the noise. Uh, I do have a business partner and I'm not certain if Cassie J is going to tell you all her business like I am. I don't know. But um, so the total that I made for the week of August 29th through September 5th was $227. What? $227? <laughs> Super excited about it. So um, what I've done with this or what I'm in planning on doing with this money is um, first up, we're going to excuse the ambulance driving by. <laughs> we're going to put $22 to taxes. I've mentioned this before. I do um, put 10% or around 10% away from my side hustles that, you know, they don't take the taxes out. Um, I feel like 10% works for our family. We typically get a tax refund. Um, and with that, you know, there's been some changes this past year. We don't know what's going to happen. So I just felt like something is better than nothing. If we have to pay, then we'll have something to put towards it. Um, and if we don't, we get to keep it. That's incredible, right? It's a little savings if we get to keep it. $40 going to gas. Don't yell at me. I know it should be more um, because if I don't have gas money, then the gas has to come from somewhere and it typically will come from my car maintenance fund. So um, going forward, I'm going to try to increase that so that way I'll have, you know, a little bit more money to dash. Next up, 40 bucks is going to business. Business! <laughs> business! Okay, this is exciting for me because, um, you know, just to get started, you have to you have to use your own money, you have to use you do resources, whatever you can. And so, um, you know, with making a couple sales and getting out there, people are showing some interest, then I can put that money back into um, our business. So I can purchase some more items, so I can create some more goodies to go into the shop. And let's do this all over again next week. <laughs> okay? All right. So... Um, from this $227, $125 is going to sinking funds. Very excited about that as well. Um, a lot of goodness um, coming all out of this video. I'm very proud of that $125 going into sinking funds. I've expressed my concern that sinking funds would fall by the wayside and um, not be stuffed. At some point, it's, it's possible. But for now, guys, that's what we're working with. So... Let's jump right in and let's stuff our envelopes for taxes. We're getting $22. So we have 20, 1, and 2. And you know what? Let's just go ahead and count this. Um, hopefully soon it'll be too big, too, too much money for me to count it because it'll just take the whole video. <laughs> so we have 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200. 
5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18. 218 dollars in taxes. That's awesome. Like I said, if we have to make payment, at least we'll have something to put towards it. That's, um, you know, worst case scenario we have to pay and we'll have it, you know. Uh, so next up, gas, getting $40, 20 and 40. And hopefully I'll dash a little bit more. Wish me luck, guys. <laughs> it's, you know, with school being in session, we don't have as much time as we did before. Um, so we're just making time for our family. All right, so this is my business envelope that Cassie J made for me. Isn't it pretty? So pretty. So we're gonna go ahead and put $40 to business, 20 and 40. Which is great because I need to get some more um, supplies to continue on creating. Uh, so this should be $125 remaining. I'll go ahead and count it up. And this is what we'll be putting towards sinking funds. 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. Yes, so $125. These are a lot of fives, but <laughs> for my sinking funds, um, I will be breaking it down, I'm pretty sure, um, into, um, you know, $5 here, $5 there, whatever I can do to make sure um, I'm stuffing those sinking funds. So you guys, that is it for this video. I want to thank you all so much for watching. I appreciate each and every one of you, all of your support, all of your kind words, just all of the greatness that is oozing from this community. Thank you a million times. So appreciative. And I want to just special thank you to um, the budgeting group that I'm a part of. There are a couple of ladies who have been just way supportive outside of you know just purchasing but words of encouragement and checking in on us and making sure we're okay i appreciate you you know who you are shout out hey girls <laughs> all right so anyway thank you guys so much for watching please like share comment and subscribe all of the things that can keep us connected I look forward to seeing you in my next video thanks for watching bye guys